Welcome to the Eastern Idaho Planning Briefing for Monday, February 10th. We'll start out with a quick summary of expected conditions across the region. We are expecting temperatures to run slightly below average for this week. We are expecting snow showers generally in the Island Park region south along the Wyoming border through the Eastern Highlands each day, today through Thursday. As a stronger system begins to work into the region late this week, we are expecting an increase in winds and precipitation chances late Thursday and especially through Friday. And this system will be the precursor for a stronger system expected this weekend. Now we'll take a look at the satellite imagery across the western United States. You can see there is a ridge of high pressure parked along the coast with generally northwest flow shifting through Idaho for the week. Uh, We are expecting several week disturbances to move through this northwest flow and that'll bring those light snow showers to the northeast corner. Here's a look at the matrix with the expected impacts for each region and you can see we do have generally light snow showers expected across some of the higher elevations today through Thursday But as we move into Friday with an increase in strength of the systems, we are expecting snow to start to impact the region beyond uh, just light snow showers. We'd also like to draw your attention to the Magic Valley where we are expecting temperatures to warm up to just above freezing Thursday into Friday as the precipitation works into the region on Friday. Some of that precipitation could be in the form of rain, but generally for Magic Valley and the lower Snake Plain, all the way up through Idaho Falls and Rexburg, we are not expecting much impact. Same for the Wood River region, but most of the higher elevations around East Idaho can expect to see some light impacts to uh, generally travel conditions for uh, snow heading into Friday. Here's a look at what we think would be a general depiction for the precipitations as as it shifts through the area today. You can see generally very light and most of that precipitation concentrated in the Island Park area and then down through the eastern highlands through today. And those snowfall amounts are expected to remain generally light, really not expecting much more than a dusting in most locations. And in fact, through the rest of the week, The accumulative snow amounts uh, for the week, uh, generally looking at at the most one to two inches for some of the higher elevations surrounding Island Park and really from the St. Anthony area uh, north to the Montana border, including the Spencer region and across the Big Hole Mountains over Pine Creek Pass, really Uh, Tuesday through Thursday, not expecting more than an inch or so of accumulation. So really not much of an impact to our road conditions. Referencing those temperatures, this is our expected highs for today. Generally, most of the region uh, generally below freezing. Pocatello could get close. American Falls, Eastern Magic Valley, and areas westward, the warmest expected for today. And those temperatures just gradually creep up through the week. So when we reference the uh, rain and snow mix headed into Thursday and Friday for these lower elevations, these are the regions that we were referring to. Any areas that would see snow late Thursday headed into Friday would be the rest of the region uh, covered in these um, temperatures below freezing. With that system coming through on Friday, we are looking at a uh, slight increase in the winds. Uh, You can see starting to get a little gusty uh, through the lower Snake River Plain and some of these higher elevations across the region on Thursday. And those winds definitely do pick up again on Friday. Could see some gusts approaching or generally slightly exceeding 30 miles per hour throughout the eastern Magic Valley possibly creeping towards the Pocatello area uh, during the day on Friday. And again, this is the precursor. We are expecting the stronger system to arrive late Saturday into Sunday with even stronger winds. Um, No details really on that just yet, but we could be looking at near wind advisory conditions with 30 mile per hour sustained across some of these areas later in the weekend. 
So in summary, for much of this week, slightly below average temperatures, very light snow showers with minimal impact and very light accumulations, generally in the Island Park region and areas south uh, Monday through Thursday, today through Thursday. Looking at precipitation chances and winds picking up late Thursday into Friday as we do get a slightly stronger system working into the region. But the stronger system is still expected uh, for the coming weekend and we'll have more details on that as we move through the week. And as always, there's a number on the screen that you can call for further information. And uh, you can also get in touch with us via email or at any of our social media sites. The next briefing will be tomorrow. Thank you for joining us.